Officer Neil Morellis is suited up and ready to patrol the streets of Beaumont. You'll get used to the sounds in his patrol truck. That tone is telling me that it's sending a radar signal out and it's receiving one. And Morellis is observant. Numbers are a key part of his job. That vehicle that just passed us before there was going 51 and the speed limit is uh, 35 over here. It doesn't take too long. Okay, that is going 60 miles an hour. To find someone going too fast on college. Afternoon, sir. Officer Morales, Beaumont Police. Uh, driver's license and insurance, please. This driver is on his way. I'm just going to write you a warning. And it's on to the next speeder. That was going to be 70 on that black one. This lead foot driver busted on major. The speed limit on on major drive is 50 miles an hour, 5-0. You were at 70 on the radar when you came past me. He gets a ticket, something he's familiar with. 1099 in the city, um, three regular warrants. This driver hasn't paid okay. for his previous citations. He owes the city of Beaumont more than $1,000. Morellis gives him a chance changing the course of this driver's day. We're gonna follow him to the court. Um, we're gonna let him go to the court to make that payment, to get that right, so that he doesn't have to go to jail. A lot of times we don't realize we're going as fast as we are. Beaumont PD Captain years, Chris uh, Schultz says waiting. speed patrols are all about public safety. By no means do we put any pressure on them to, uh, to write a certain number of tickets or, uh, or even keep up with how much uh, revenue that is for uh, for the city that that part we just don't care about but i imagine some citizens probably assume that you do <laughs> uh yes you you uh you got that one right uh, a lot of citizens think that that's all we're doing is trying to uh, uh fund the next uh, toy that we might uh, want as a police department but that's absolutely not uh, not the case how's it going Good, good. I'm Deputy Manuel with Rose City. The reason for the stop is your speed. Rose City is home to 330 people, but deputies write hundreds of tickets each year, covering 1.7 miles of Interstate 10 in Orange County. What's the most you've clocked somebody? 138 miles per hour. 138? Yes, sir. What kind of car was that? It was a sports bike. Deputy Danielle Manuel says when she was training, this philosophy stuck with her. Traffic enforcement should never be implemented as a punishment, but more of a corrective action. I could have given you a warning, yes sir, but I mean you're doing 15 miles an hour over the posted speed limit. And she hopes drivers know why she's out here doing what she's doing. Ultimately, at the end of the day, what boils down is, you know, I want my family safe. I know that you want your family safe. And we all live here. You know, we all have to drive here. And that just kind of goes...